All right, folks, welcome back. Let's play Gaga 13, top secret episode. Let's get aboard the mysterious helicopter and pursue the mysterious fake to Alexander Island, although we have to chase him there again because Zach 10 from here to eternity ain't no continuation points, bitches. This is where the game gets serious. Serious about mufflers. And now I'm like out of bullets, great. Do not want to be out of bullets against that guy. For some reason, I decided to let him get close to me when I really didn't have any reason to do that. Shit. I feel like the game ends at Alexander Island. I don't know what the last couple of acts are about. So far, we've been to Germany, then to Greece, then we were in South America, where the infamous Fangbacks building is, and then now we're flying around Antarctica. We went from Rio to Antarctica. That at least makes some sense. I mean, Argentina is a long country, and it's kind of plausible that you could get to, if you're going to fly from a populated landmass to Antarctica, South America, or bleh, Argentina would be a good one. To choose. Alright, that was important that I was able to do that quickly. It wasn't good that I sucked so bad there. They appear to swoop back up here. I don't know if it actually works that way or not. Or if they just drop from wherever. Okay. There we go. Boo, 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 do, 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 do. do, 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 do. I am getting tired of the stage. Do, 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 do. There's nothing wrong with this stage in particular. I kind of want the plot to advance and. My own ineptitude, coupled with the game having suddenly become really unforgiving, has uh, prevented that from happening. And this whole, like, your life drains away mechanic is really kind of irritating when you get to those submarines and there's... You've got a couple of minutes there where there's nothing you can do to stop it. Your murderous blood rage cannot be sated. Can't contain my blood rage. Look out! I quote it in case you're interested, because uh, I think that gets referenced occasionally in my LPs, maybe Bobo's too. It's from King of the Fighters Maximum Impact for the PS2, which is not really that great a game. <laughs> it's not bad or anything. Mysterious Fake has landed on Alexander Island. So, which fake? Are we ch chasing the fake uh, regular guy? That, are we chasing annoying blue dude whom I happen to know? from the credits is nicknamed Fake Enormous. There's no reason you would know that if you hadn't already seen the credits, though. So I don't think we're... I mean, we shouldn't be expected to know that, but maybe the game just isn't being that careful about this. Ah, oh, fuck you. I'm out of here. Ah, shit. That was a bad idea. Okay. I was about to say, maybe I should die here intentionally. Not gonna be a problem. <laughs> I was gonna say, I should die here intentionally if I don't come out of it with almost full health. Shit. Whoa, how much damage did that missile do? I mean, I realize as I'm saying this, it's like a guy in a tuxedo getting hit with a missile. <laughs> I shouldn't really be that upset if it seems to be enough to kill him, but... The rules for how much damage these things do change, like, arbitrarily. Continue 10. Damn it. Wow. And what even hit me there? Oi, it's getting old. And how do I keep managing to not kill that one? Oh, I suck, apparently. 
Now I'm going to be parked here waiting for it. And something did 50 damage to me from off screen. Okay. Now that was just like some really fancy shooting on my part, I must say. I don't know how much better than that the game expects me to do. Oh, fuck you, last missile. Alright, no moonwalking. It's time to get serious about mufflers and getting shot by these hookers of death and shooting me in the balls. To make sure that I know I got thoroughly trounced. Now it's time to do the helicopter stage again. This is getting old. Alright, well, you know, we already know that I couldn't beat the game fair and square. So I think it's time to start abusing save states outside of the Fangbacks building. Just because I'm sick of doing that same stage again. And I would think you're probably going to be sick of watching it. So yeah, I'm going to be cheating a little bit from here on out. I'm just going to... I mean, using the level select code, I could keep trying and trying and trying until I get past that screen. I just can't imagine you want to watch that. So... Yeah. You let me know, folks, in your comments. We'll keep a running tally. Who likes to watch uh, pure LPs where there's no cheating involved and... I doubt that there'll be that many of you, because at this point you probably wouldn't still be watching my channel. There are games where I don't cheat at all. Like, I do frame skip in Breath of Fire games and stuff like that, but... Then again, I did a little bit of save state cheating in that game, just to, just to show you different, different like dialogue options. I don't think I ever cheated outright in the game. Damn, I just totally fouled that up. I was about to say, the real key is being able to kill the planes quickly. Fuck. And I missed Life 13. I usually like to comment on Life 13 in some way. Anyway, the sub... If the sub is what's hurting me from off screen, it won't be a problem anymore. You got one of each left to deal with. Got rid of you. You guys are the major pain in the ass. You guys are a lesser pain in the ass. Hard to kill, but... Jeez, guys. Come on, now. Come on, buddy. Hey, we haven't seen one of them from uh, above for a little while. I mean, where it's below us, you know what I mean. Safe state I'm even on. I think that's the one I want to be on. JG is a cheater. He cannot win fair. He has to use safe states to beat a game that was made for eight year olds. This game was meant for eight year olds. It was a Nintendo launch title. Grown ups did not play games back then. I couldn't beat a toddler. Well, the thing about it is, is this was a launch title meant for eight-year-olds, but it was a ludicrously over-difficult launch title for eight-year-olds. And eight-year-olds aren't even going to get to this stage because they'll have already, like, broken their Nintendo in frustration at the Fangbacks building part. I believe that was Act 7, Sleeping Beauty. We're now into Act 10, Apocalypse Now, possibly From Here to Eternity. I've forgotten what movie name we're using now. The mysterious fake has vanished on Alexander Island. Alexander Nevsky. Now that I'm using save states, I can moonwalk again. <laughs> Although, once again, that will screw it all up. State. Right in the face. That one should have blown up so close that we both got killed by it. Let's 
just, uh, yeah, just stand around in his body, Galgo. That's a great idea. Alright, well, you know what, fuck it. If I die here, I die. If it bleeds, we can kill it. If it sucks, we can kill it. <laughs> oh, come on, JG. Sleep at the wheel there, buddy. I went after the plane when clearly my target should have been the helicopter and... I mean, the helicopter when my target should have been the plane. Then I changed my mind. You gotta commit to one or the other, JG. Oh, just textbook how not to do these stages. Once you've picked a target, you've gotta commit. But I did pick the wrong one. Should have gotten the plane, not gone after the helicopter. Usually, you can't hit the helicopters when they're in this animation. At least I can't. Okay, and I get the sub. Ah, uh, you fucking bastard. But, save anyway. Shoots a missile right as it's dying so that I can't get out with full health. Yeah, that was fun. Zombie hookers of death. Hookers of being dead. Ah, screw you. I'm just hoping that the stage is almost over. Considering you know, I wasn't meant to be using save states here, it probably is pretty close. Aren't you guys cold? I know I am. Act 11, The Godfather. See, I was close, folks. I almost got out before. So here we are in The Godfather's secret boiler room, where um, he has a bunch of delicious frozen fish. Luca Brazzi sleeps in here, of course. Well, you wouldn't have them in your boiler room, but, um, you've finally gotten to this base, but you've always turned the impossible into the possible. I think he said that already, buddy. But I don't think you can stand this place any longer. Yeah, he pretty much said all this. Um, da 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 da. Yeah, speak of repeating yourself, our bows will teach you what souvenirs you can bring back from here. Wonderful Bose headphones, like high-quality merchandise, I'm telling you. The Germans really know how to make headphones, assuming that the Germans are Bose. I know that the Germans are etwas Boses. He's sleeping somewhere deep into this base. <laughs> Our Bose is sleeping deep into this base. You won't be able to hit him. Da -da -da. Oh, fuck you, game. Fuck you. I don't think this was an actual maze. I think it's more of just like a little first-person sequence that they threw in for some reason. So th I'm pretty sure they're not going to try to top the Fangbacks maze. I would remember that. Yeah, we're just kind of going into like a spiral here. At the center is... A way down... Ooh. Oh, great, there are more than one way to go now. Uh, it's just, just a health bonus. I think this is like a boss fight coming up as opposed to a maze. I hope so. Certainly, if it's a maze, it seems to be a maze which doesn't have a lot of different places you can go. Pretty linear kind of maze. Didn't I just... Yeah, I think I just messed this up. I got turned around. Okay, so we go through here, and here, and here, and here. We go straight through here. We go straight again. And then this just leads to here, when there's nothing. Alright, um, don't know what's going on with that. Didn't really feel like a, a proper maze, but I'm not complaining. <laughs> I really uh, did not particularly want to do another maze. Uh, now we're almost at the 15 minute mark, and so there's really dramatic music playing, so it seems like a good place to end it. When we come back, we're going to find out what's going on in the Godfather's uh, submarine, or wherever the hell we are, and um, sub-arctic base place... Thing. 
Space is the place, ooh yeah. We're gonna blast off from the outer space in a million miles a second in the next video, yeah. Except we're not actually gonna do that, no. This is the Macho Man, Mr. SGG, telling you to come back next time where I apologize for desecrating the memory of the Macho Man, ooh yeah.